guys and welcome back. Today we are opening up my summer FabFitFun box and I can't wait to see what goodies are in store. So I am an annual UK member of FabFitFun. I have been subscribed to them for quite a while now and I'm really excited to see what is in this summer box 2022. Mm. So let's dive inside and see. I have picked some items myself. I chose some of them and some I put as a surprise. So first of all I see the card that has a code if anyone wants $15 off their first box. There it is. Um, there's also some stickers and then the magazine that just has lots of information about various products inside but I want to see what's in the box so let's dive inside and see what there is so taking off the packaging okay so the first item that I see is this free people Cara seamless bralette now I got it in XXL because I am quite busty I have a larger bust size generally go from a 38 double D sometimes to an F cup so I went with the larger one and it fits beautifully it doesn't give much support especially if you're bustier but it's really nice it fits beautifully and I love the design it has beautiful pattern on it it has like this ribbed fabrication which is supposed to give extra support but it doesn't give that much support if you are bustier like me but it is really nice just to wear under a tee if you don't want to wear a bra next I see this body scrubber now I wasn't too sure about this but I'm excited to sort of try it and see I'm not sure how scrubby it's going to be now this was one of my mystery surprises because I couldn't decide what to pick and it supposedly retails for 15 dollars I mean it's basically like a silicon body scrub and um, it's a bit wiggly it's a nice color um it reminds me a little bit of the dish cleaning ones you get so um I will let you know how I get on with that so next I really needed a mascara so as soon as I saw this was an item I had to pick it. It is the um, Fenty Beauty by Rihanna mascara. It retails for $24 um, and it's supposed to be really good. It's supposed to extend um, and lift and curl your uh, eyelashes so I'm excited to try it and see how it will do and it says it shouldn't run. It's water resistance along wear so I'm very much looking forward to trying it and seeing what it's like. I desperately needed a new mascara so it was excellent this was an option in the box I was really pleased with that and it is black the color is black um so looking forward to giving that one a try so next is the uh I don't know how to pronounce it Ahava um it's a all essential day moisturizer for combination skin it's vegan and it supposedly retails for $69 it is quite a big tube which is great $69 is a lot of money so anyway I'm looking forward to trying that I do love a moisturizer and I also got this conditioner um and the conditioner is for like color treated hair um it's supposed to extend color vibrancy and it retails for $24 um so I'm excited to try that one too um I always love a good conditioner so I'm looking forward to giving that one a go and again it's a really good size it's cruelty free and vegan um, and it's 100% recyclable packaging, which is great too. So looking forward to giving that one a go. I've got a lot more beauty products this season than I usually get. Um, so next is this Wish uh, Firming Sleep Mask. And it retails for $58, which is obscenely expensive. Um, it has aloe, chamomile and horse chestnut extract and it's supposed to help skin feel calm and soothed and it's supposed to be really moisturising so I'm looking forward to giving that a go. It's quite a good sized pot as well um, which is excellent and I do like overnight masks I often find they are very good um, and then next I've got this uh, they're really cute little pots um, the, it's a multi-use storage pot. There's two of them. And for two, they retail for $45. Again, very expensive. Um, it says that it is food contact safe. But I've decided to use them in the bathroom. I've put like cotton wool buds and um, cotton pads in them. Because they're really cute. And it does say that the body and lid are dishwasher safe. Which I think is excellent too. So you can clean them in the dishwasher as well. Um, some people use them in offices. Some people might use them in the bathrooms. Some people might use them in the kitchens. So they are really good because they are like multi-purpose. Um, and they do look really nice. Overall I have to say my, I think my favourite items that I've got is the mascara. 
um, the little pots and the bralette. Um, although I am really excited to try the overnight sleep mask. Anyway guys, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Let me know what your favourite item is. And do not forget to slay that subscribe button. I hope that you all have a wonderful, magical, amazing day wherever you are in the world. And I will catch you all very soon.